What's happening guys? It's Amy Nicholas back again talking to you about passive income streams. My favorite, creating stock video footage, selling that footage for years and years to come. Um, I'm going to go over my sales for September 2022. I am an exclusive contributor now on the website called Pond5. That's the number five. Um, and I got some interesting news to share with you about that in my first month being exclusive. Uh, quick note, though, I'm beginning now to accept hungry clients, okay, who are ready to build a serious passive income that can pay you for years and even decades to come. That's been the case for me uh, in profit. So if that sounds like you, um, I'll coach you on what to shoot, how to shoot it, how to edit it, how to keyword, and how to get your first sale as fast as humanly possible. Uh, if that sounds interesting to you, you can shoot me an email at createbusinessfreedom at gmail.com, or I'll have my Telegram uh, user info down below in the description. You can check that out and message me on Telegram if you're on Telegram. So, all right, uh, let's get into it. So, like I said, first month being exclusive. Uh, I'm going to share my screen here with you. Interesting to note, um, with the exclusivity, that means I cannot upload the same clips that I put on Pond5. I cannot upload them anywhere else. I could upload different clips to another website if I so choose to. I just can't put those also on Pond5. Um, I now get 60% royalty of my sale based upon the price point that I put on my listings and occasionally I've seen it where it pays me even more depending on the type of license that the person who bought, who bought the clip purchased. So here we have Amy's dashboard for September, 2022. I sold two clips, okay? Now, what's interesting to note here is last month I also sold two clips in August and I believe it came out to like 80 some dollars. You can watch one of my earlier videos on this channel uh, where I shared what I earned. And yeah, it was like $85 or something like that for two clips sold, right? This time I sold two clips and I earned $214.56. Okay, so being exclusive has already begun to pay off for me. Um, that's what, like a 3X income almost. So yeah, kind of cool. Um, what I sold, I will show you, let's see if I can click on this. No, I can't. Okay. I will, um, hang on a second here. Let's stop that for a moment. I'm going to jump over to my listings and show you exactly what those clips were that did sell. Um, wish I could click on them. That would have been nice. Just a moment there. Yeah, one of them that sold too um, was for, well, both of them that sold were for a nice amount. Um, but the one that sold for the higher amount was a sale for a 4K clip. And I have sold 4K clips, but it's been a while, okay? Um, probably because I didn't have that many <laughs> and both of these clips. Okay. So I've been uploading very actively for the last like six weeks or so. And both of these clips, um, they are not from my, uh, my newest stuff. Okay. These are old clips, which is totally fine. Like I don't, you know, hey, sales are sales. I'm not going to cry about, you know, I didn't sell something new. It's totally to be expected because what that means is um, that it takes a, a while for new clips to get indexed, put into the Pond5 search results. Um, somewhere between the four months to a year sometimes could be the time frame if they sell. All right. Now I was looking at some of my stuff and realized that some things had sold after six years. Okay. So you never know when it's going to make a sale. And that's why I never look at, you know, this whole 80, 20 thing as being a bad thing. Like, yeah, 80% 
of your sales will probably come from 20% of your clips, but that's okay because they're going to make up for the ones that didn't sell. And you never know the ones that didn't sell. And you're like, Oh, they're never going to sell. They can still make a sale, right? This is like the most legitimate passive income. Once you've done the work up front, like these clips are live, they're for sale. As long as the company, you know, doesn't go under, which I've been with Pond five now since 2012 full decade, they're still around. In fact, they're one of the top, uh, you know, names in the industry. Now they weren't when I first started uploading. So I was very happy that they were still around and that they were paying so well. That's why I went exclusive with them. Okay. So let me go back and share and I'll show you guys. Um, first I'll show you the HD clip that sold. Okay. So, um, this is a clip I shot. <laughs> it looks nice and smooth, right? On a DSLR. Let me explain how I got the shot. <laughs> yes, I was driving. Maybe not the best thing to do while trying to shoot footage, but hey, whatever it takes to get the shot. I'm driving in Kansas with my DSLR like in the seat next to me, okay? And I'm like, oh, well, this would be an interesting shot just to have like, you know, it's a travel sign and it specifically said Wichita, which is in Kansas. And I was like, oh, if I could, you know, grab that clip, I'll, I'll get it. So I had the DSLR up on the dash, very carefully holding it to keep it stable. Um, I want to say I didn't even put any stabilizing um, effect on it in the editing when I edited in uh, Adobe Premiere Pro. I don't think I even had to. It actually came out really smooth. The roads were real smooth there. And I got my shot and I was like, sweet. And this shot has actually sold for me numerous times. Um, I think at least two or three times I've sold this shot now. And I uploaded this 2014, I think it was. Yeah, I think it was in 2014 that I uploaded this clip. So very cool to see an HD clip. So like 1080p uh, sell all this time later, um, you know, years and years later. And, you know, 4K is becoming more in demand, but it's not taken over the stock footage industry. So that's really encouraging for me because, you know, like 90% of my footage that's uploaded is in HD and not 4K yet. So, yeah. Um, so I priced this at 139 being exclusive. Amy earned uh, $83.40 from this one sale. Okay. Had I not been exclusive, um, I think they pay 35%. If you're not exclusive, I would have only made it $48.65. So that was cool. Um, the other clip that sold is actually, yes, 4K, and it's a time lapse. And I shot this sucker on, I believe I shot it on my, uh, I'm trying to remember if I shot it on my GoPro <laughs> or if I shot it on the DSLR. Um, I think... It's a so long ago. I can't even remember. I could go into the, the data there and probably find out, but um, one of the two. <laughs> Anyways, it was in a 4K frame rate. It had to have been my GoPro because I can't, yeah, I couldn't do 4K on, on the Canon T5i, uh, which was my DSLR. So yeah, it's in 4K, had to have been the GoPro. Actually, the GoPro, and this is the Hero 3, okay? This is like ages ago for GoPro. That camera actually did pretty good in low light, which I don't even know how I got such a good shot. It must've just been enough lights uh, at night on because normally it does not do well in the light. So cool that I got a time lapse from it. Cool that it um, came out, you know, with the lighting. And they used to have something called the GoPro Studio back in the day that you would import your footage to. I think I did minor tweaks in there to get the coloring and stuff. It was just pretty easy after that. Um, they put the clips together if it's done like a time lapse and yeah, easy peasy. So somebody bought the 4K version and I made $131.16 from that sale, which was pretty sweet because I hadn't been earning anywhere near that kind of money for stock footage in a very long time since a lot of these companies that I was selling footage on they were like slashing what they were paying in royalties. Okay. So um, companies like Shutterstock and even Pond5, Pond5 used to pay 50% not being exclusive, okay? Just like you're just selling stuff there. They used to pay you 50% of whatever your price was. 
And then they, you know, like everybody else, they brought that way down and they were paying like 30, 35%. So yeah, big deal for me. And maybe you would consider this too, if you're looking to get started in stock footage, go exclusive. Okay. Cause right out the gate, you're making way more money and your time is better spent focused on one website. I've watched like almost every single video I can find on YouTube about shooting stock video footage because there's very few of them. <laughs> um, so I hope you're enjoying this and you're getting value. And if you like seeing these sales, smash the like button and give me a subscribe because I'm going to be talking more about this. But of all these videos, there's so many people that are telling other people to go on every website, be on everything, you know, and then oftentimes they're promoting um black box or i'm trying to think what's the other one there's another one oh wire stock sorry guys i got something right here um wire stock or black box and the thing is these people no offense they're full-time videographers professional people they are not doing stock footage as a as a full-time not even close thank you hubby <laughs> cut the grass um but their let's just say their motivation their intentions is in a different playing field because they're thinking of it as hey i got all this extra footage on my phone i got this extra footage on my camera let me throw it up on this one website and they'll just distribute it everywhere for me and cool i don't have to worry about it problem with that is you're taking fractions of the sale from wherever you're selling these clips like for example on black box if you upload footage there they're going to distribute it out for you. Oftentimes, I think they even do the keywords and stuff for you, which sounds great. You know, less time. Problem is they take a big old fat cut of your sale. OK, I think it's somewhere in the neighborhood of 15 percent. Seeing as how some of these sites are already taking a lot of your money anyway <laughs> when you sell something or they're setting the prices so ridiculously low that when they do pay you, it's like this. OK, um, I can just highly recommend not doing those websites. Okay. I have not personally been on them, but because I've done the research, I can say that it's just well worth your time. If you stick to one and you go exclusive. Um, now the ability to go exclusive, I don't even know, um, the other channels like Adobe stock, Shutterstock, uh, Getty images. I'm not even sure at this point, which ones you can go exclusive on. I'm only familiar with Pond5. So if you want to go exclusive with somebody and you want like the highest payouts and you want the best, um, you know, percentage of your money and be able to set your prices, Pond5. Okay. Um, so that's my rant. You know, you can listen to these other people. That's cool. But just keep in mind, they are just trying to gather a little bit of extra money uh, from what they already have. The, the time they've already spent shooting for other projects, they're not looking at this as a single business. They're looking at it as extra goodies. Okay. So they're willing to take less money for someone to do the work for them. Uh, but that's not me because I'd rather have my 60%. Okay. <laughs> that's just me. So real happy about um, September went up obviously from selling the same amount of clips went from 80 some dollars to 214 dollars um you know if you want to learn how to do this the right way okay avoiding the mistakes avoiding the uh re chance of getting your videos rejected um you know waiting forever and ever and ever to make a sale uh reach out to me if you're interested like i said i, I can take on about two clients right now uh for one-on-one -on -one consulting to help you grow your stock footage business and i'll just I'm just going to lay it out. This is what you need to do. This is, you know, approximately how long it's going to take. And I'm going to help you get that very first sale as soon as possible. Okay. So reach out to me. There's my telegram down below and my email is create business freedom at gmail.com. You can click on that below as well in the description. If you like this video, if you want to see my October sales, when that comes up, let me know, leave a comment. Um, also let me know, are you signed up for pond five? Did you sign up for any site yet? Have you shot any footage? Are you needing help in one specific area just to get started? Let me know. Comment down below and I'll see you in the next video.